What do you say to people who might not be supporting legal marijuana and who see you as helping introduce uh, another, you know, intoxicant to society with all the, you know, social co health, health costs which might be associated with that. W what's your response to those kind of criticisms of, of legal marijuana? Yeah, you know, I, I don't think marijuana or cannabis has had a fair shake, right? I, I really don't. I think it's been demonized over the years. You know, I'm a product of the 70s and 80s, and, you know, I'm a product of the just say no and, and you know, the, the potential hazards caused by cannabis. But, you know, unfortunately, it can't be studied right now. It's still illegal, right? So you can't bring it into a lab. You can't uh, bring it into an institution. You can't because of federal it. laws that ban, essentially ban that, and with very rare exceptions. Right. right. Right, and so you know, there, there ha it hasn't been given a fair shake, right? We want to bring it out of, out of the darkness and into the light. You know, we don't uh, necessarily claim that there's going to be these, you know, wildly fantastic benefits from it. But you know, I, let's let's study it. Like, let's bring it to a lab. You know, let's 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 find out the actual cannabinoids and, and see what they do. Let's let's put it through trials, right? But it, it, so it, it, it's really it's really not a fair judgment for somebody to come in and you know just you know, blatantly say it's it's another, you know, next new drug that's going to be legalized. Uh, but on the other hand, you're, you're being pretty honest by talking, comparing this industry to the alcohol industry. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're putting it on the same level as alcohol, which obviously can be abused and there's a social cost, um, but it's legal. Um, we, we moved out of prohibition. So it seems like you're, there's a little bit more honesty in your argument there than purely putting it in a drug, comparing it to other drugs, uh, legal drugs. Yeah, look, it's, it's mainstream. It's, it's been mainstream. Right, uh, you, you go to a dispensary and you sit there for 30 minutes, an hour, and you see people come through and, and buy cannabis. I mean, it's, it's no different than the DMV, right? I mean, you're not seeing the B-rail of, of, you know, some 18-year-old stoner sitting in a park, you know, smoking a joint. I mean, that's, that's not the reality of cannabis.